Welcome, friends, to Star Wars Outlaws from Ubisoft and Massive Games. I'm Machinosaur, and I'm excited to share our recent hands-on gameplay experience thanks to Ubisoft. We were able to play around four hours of Outlaws and look at many of its features. From the crowded cantinas to stormtroopers running local security, Outlaws does a great job of capturing the Star Wars feel we all know from the films. Set between the events of Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi, we find our character, Kay Vess, trying to survive in a world controlled by the Empire and several crime syndicates all hungry for power. Let me see some identification. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. You're Torn Valerio Nup? That's me. Mm -hmm. All right, move along. Kay is trying to get her start as a smuggler taking on jobs for these crime syndicates. That said, a friend needs a little something stolen from Gorak's private base. Some information he'd hate to get out. And who's hiring me to steal from the top syndicate in town? <laughs> Sorry, kid. In or out. That's all you get. Choices in your mission and dialogue will improve or hurt your relationship your client, with each of the crime syndicates. The syndicates all demand fierce loyalty, and each of Kay's choices will affect her reputation with the other syndicates. A large part of the game centers around this reputation system. Steal from the huts, and risk no longer being deal. able to use their exclusive course, vendors in game. Make a deal with Crimson Dawn, and the pikes will throw you out of their local stronghold. You must stop. Need to keep an eye out. Hey, you were right. They uh, won't let me in. There's another way. A vent around the corner nearby. Okay, if they see you... I know, I know. It'd be bad. One thing every scoundrel knows is hokey religions and ancient weapons are no match for a good blaster at your side. With Kay's VM-19 Heavy Blaster, you can shoot your way out of many situations. The blaster has full customization, upgrade modules, and even a stun mode. Best of all, Kay's Blaster allows you to do a slow motion marking system, similar to Deadeye from Red Dead Redemption. Multiple foes can be marked before Kay unleashes a deadly volley of blaster fire. All right. If Kay's Blaster isn't enough, you can grab up one of your enemy's drop weapons and blast away. The only thing you will keep closer than your blaster is your lovable companion, Nyx. Hey, buddy, hit that button. Nyx has a number of abilities to assist Kay. They can fetch items, Nyx, snatch that. pull switches, you got it, hit the button, Nyx, and cause distractions. Go put on a show, Nyx. There are a few puzzles where Nyx was essential to the solution. Think you can hold that open for me? Cool. Nyx had a lot of practical hey, application in the game go. while still being an adorable companion. While blasting stormtroopers and sending Nyx to attack enemies was a ton of fun, the base of the gameplay was centered around stealth and movement. Several missions had us infiltrating crime syndicate strongholds and Empire space stations. You truly feel like a smuggler up to no good while sneaking in the game. Whether crawling through vents, descending from ropes, or using Nyx to turn off alarms and cameras, the stealth gameplay was wonderful. And what stealth gameplay would be complete without good take cuts? Uh, 
Often stealth movement meant getting behind locked doors and stealing valuable intel. That's where the game's hacking mechanics come into play. K carries a device called the Data Spike that can be used to unlock doors with an interesting rhythm-based mechanic. Encrypted file. K can also slice terminals to gather intel. The slicing mechanic has you matching symbols in their positions to access data on a locked terminal. When you need a break from the life of crime, Star Wars Outlaws provides plenty of distractions. Side missions are plentiful and feature interesting characters with their own storylines. Uh, didn't quite get that. Thieves have stolen my motivation actuator. Please end my humiliation. That's what the little guy said. Aren't you gonna help? Not my droid. You can race speeders. Hey, you look like you can handle yourself on a speeder. You want to race? Bet on Fathers live from Canto Bite. and even play everyone's favorite Star Wars game, Sabacc. Sabacc. Maybe you just want to enjoy the open world on your speeder. I guess this is life for us now, huh, Or our own. Whoa. <laughs> Check out the ship, Nix. Walk us or perhaps crazy. fly to space in your Karelian EML-850 light freighter named the Trailblazer. Engage in epic space battles or smuggle yourself on board an Imperial space station, all from on board the Trailblazer. With a diverse cast of characters and locations, some of which you will know from the Star Wars films, it is super easy to get wrapped up in the world of Star Wars Outlaws. Thank you again to Ubisoft for allowing us to play the game and share it with you. I look forward to playing the game live on launch over at twitch.tv slash machinasaur. If you enjoyed our video and are looking forward to Star Wars Outlaws, please like and subscribe. Thank you, friends, for Let's watching. Jump. I've been Machinist.